Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're delving into the lives of 20 celebrities who seem to have disappeared from the limelight. From once iconic stars to rising talents, these individuals have left fans wondering where they've gone. Join us as we uncover the reasons behind their disappearances and explore what they've been up to since vanishing from the public eye. Now, let's get started. Kevin Spacey is an American actor born on July 26, 1959, in South Orange, New Jersey. He rose to fame for his captivating performances in films like The Usual Suspects and American Beauty, earning him critical acclaim and multiple awards, including Oscars. Throughout his career, Spacey was regarded as one of Hollywood's finest actors, known for his versatility and charisma. However, in 2017, allegations of sexual misconduct surfaced against him, which severely tarnished his reputation and career. Numerous individuals accused him of inappropriate behavior, leading to legal battles and his exile from the entertainment industry. Spacey's downfall was swift and impactful. His once thriving career came to a halt as projects were cancelled, and roles were recast to distance themselves from the controversy. Since then, Spacey has largely disappeared from the public eye, with occasional brief appearances. As of now, Kevin Spacey is 64 years old, his once illustrious career overshadowed by the scandal that brought his downfall. Mel Gibson is an Australian-American actor, filmmaker, and screenwriter born on January 3, 1956, in Peekskill, New York. He gained worldwide fame for his roles in action films like Mad Max and Lethal Weapon, as well as his directorial efforts such as Braveheart, which earned him Academy Awards for Best Director and Best Picture. Gibson's career reached great heights, but his personal life became marred by controversies. He faced criticism for making anti-Semitic remarks during a 2006 DUI arrest, tarnishing his reputation and leading to a significant backlash. Despite apologizing and seeking reconciliation, his actions continued to haunt him. The fallout from Gibson's controversies resulted in a decline in his Hollywood presence. He faced difficulties securing leading roles and directing projects, with many in the industry hesitant to work with him. As a result, Gibson largely retreated from the spotlight, focusing on smaller projects and occasional acting roles. Currently, Mel Gibson is 68 years old, his once prominent career overshadowed by the controversies that derailed his trajectory. Felicity Huffman, born on December 9, 1962, in Bedford, New York, rose to fame through her acting prowess in both television and film. She garnered widespread acclaim for her roles in projects like Desperate Housewives and Transamerica, for which she received an Academy Award nomination. However, Huffman faced a significant setback in 2019 when she became embroiled in the college admissions bribery scandal. She admitted to paying $15,000 to have her daughter's SAT scores falsified, pleading guilty to fraud charges. The scandal tarnished her reputation and led to legal consequences, including a short prison sentence and community service. The fallout from the scandal had a detrimental impact on Huffman's career, leading to a hiatus from the spotlight. However, she expressed remorse for her actions and sought redemption. Today, at the age of 61, Huffman's career trajectory remains uncertain, as she continues to navigate the aftermath of her involvement in the scandal. Cameron Diaz is an American actress, producer, and author. Born on August 30, 1972, in San Diego, California, she rose to fame in the 1990s with roles in films like The Mask, There's Something About Mary, and Charlie's Angels. Diaz's career was marked by versatility, showcasing her comedic timing and ability to tackle diverse roles. Despite her success, Diaz faced criticism for some of her film choices and acting abilities in certain roles. However, her charismatic presence and box office appeal often outweighed any negative reception. In recent years, Diaz has shifted her focus away from acting, with her last major film role being in 2014's Annie. 
She announced her retirement from acting in 2018 to focus on other pursuits, including writing and wellness advocacy. Now, Cameron Diaz is 51 years old, enjoying a quieter life away from the spotlight. Lori Laughlin is an American actress and producer, born on July 28, 1964, in Queens, New York. She gained widespread recognition for her role as Rebecca Donaldson Katsopoulos in the beloved sitcom Full House during the late 1980s and early 1990s. Lachlan's career extended beyond Full House, with notable roles in television series and made-for-TV movies. However, her reputation suffered a severe blow in 2019 when she became embroiled in the college admissions bribery scandal. Laughlin and her husband were accused of paying bribes to secure their daughter's admission to prestigious universities. The scandal led to public outrage and legal repercussions for Laughlin and her family. Following the scandal, Lachlan's career took a nosedive. She faced backlash from fans and the industry, resulting in her being dropped from various projects and partnerships. In 2020, she was sentenced to two months in prison for her involvement in the scandal. Presently, Lori Laughlin is 59 years old, having largely retreated from the public eye following the scandal. Paula Dean is an American chef, author, and television personality, born on January 19, 1947, in Albany, Georgia. She gained widespread fame for her southern cooking style and cheerful demeanor on cooking shows such as Paula's Home Cooking and Paula's Party. Dean's career soared with her numerous cookbooks, restaurants, and endorsement deals. However, in 2013, Dean faced severe backlash when it was revealed that she had used racial slurs in the past and tolerated a discriminatory work environment in her restaurants. The revelation led to the cancellation of her cooking shows, the loss of several endorsement deals, and damage to her reputation. Following the controversy, Dean largely disappeared from the spotlight. While she attempted a comeback with a digital network and new projects, her career never fully recovered from the scandal. As of now, Paula Dean is 77 years old, living a quieter life away from the intense scrutiny of her earlier years in the culinary world. James Franco is an American actor, filmmaker, and academic, born on April 19, 1978, in Palo Alto, California. He first gained widespread recognition for his role on the TV series Freaks and Geeks in the late 1990s. Franco's career flourished with roles in films like Spider-Man, 127 Hours, and Pineapple Express, showcasing his versatility as an actor. However, Franco's career took a hit when multiple women accused him of inappropriate behavior and sexual misconduct in 2018 as part of the hashtag MeToo movement. The allegations led to backlash, tarnishing his reputation and resulting in the cancellation of projects and endorsement deals. Following the allegations, Franco retreated from the spotlight and faced a decline in his acting and directing opportunities. While he continued to work on smaller projects, his once prominent presence in Hollywood diminished. Currently, James Franco is 45 years old, navigating a quieter career path compared to his earlier years in the industry. Charlie Sheen is an American actor born on September 3, 1965, in New York City. He rose to fame for his roles in iconic films such as Platoon and Wall Street, but it was his portrayal of Charlie Harper on the TV sitcom Two and a Half Men that solidified his status as a household name. Sheen's career was marked by both critical acclaim and personal turmoil. Despite his success, Sheen faced public struggles with substance abuse and legal issues. His erratic behavior, public meltdowns, and controversial statements led to his departure from Two and a Half Men in 2011. Following his highly publicized meltdown, Sheen's career went into decline. While he attempted a comeback with the TV series Anger Management, his tumultuous past continued to overshadow his professional endeavors. Today, 
Charlie Sheen is 58 years old, with his once prominent acting career largely overshadowed by the controversies and personal struggles that defined his public image. Katherine Heigl is an American actress and producer, born on November 24, 1978, in Washington, D.C. She gained prominence for her role as Dr. Izzy Stevens on the medical drama series Grey's Anatomy. Heigl's portrayal earned her critical acclaim and a Primetime Emmy Award. Following her success on Grey's Anatomy, Heigl transitioned to film, starring in romantic comedies like Knocked Up and 27 Dresses. However, despite initial success, Heigl's career faced challenges due to her reputation for being difficult to work with. She publicly criticized the writing of Grey's Anatomy and later expressed regret for her comments, but the damage was done. Heigl's reputation for unprofessionalism and outspokenness led to a decline in leading roles and diminished opportunities in Hollywood. Despite attempts to revive her career with television projects and film roles, she struggled to regain her former status. Now. Katherine Heigl is 45 years old, with her career having experienced a notable downturn compared to her earlier successes. Roseanne Barr is an American actress, comedian, and television producer, born on November 3, 1952, in Salt Lake City, Utah. She gained widespread fame for her groundbreaking sitcom Roseanne, which aired from 1988 to 1997. The show depicted the everyday struggles of a working-class family, earning Barr critical acclaim and multiple awards, including an Emmy. Despite her success, Barr's career faced a significant setback in 2018 when she posted a racially charged tweet, leading to the cancellation of the reboot of Roseanne and widespread condemnation. The tweet resulted in Barr being labeled as racist, and she faced backlash from both fans and the industry. Following the controversy, Barr largely disappeared from the spotlight, with her reputation tarnished and career prospects diminished. Despite attempts to revive her career through stand-up comedy and other projects, she struggled to regain her former prominence. Presently, Roseanne Barr is 71 years old, her once thriving career overshadowed by the controversy that marred her legacy. Bill Cosby, born on July 12, 1937, in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, is an American comedian, actor, and producer. He rose to fame in the 1960s with his stand-up comedy routines, particularly his clean, family-friendly humor. Cosby became a household name with his role as Dr. Cliff Huxtable on the hit sitcom The Cosby Show, which aired from 1984 to 1992, earning him widespread acclaim and cementing his status as an entertainment icon. However, Cosby's reputation was tarnished in recent years by numerous allegations of sexual assault and misconduct spanning decades. In 2018, he was convicted of drugging and sexually assaulting Andrea Constant in 2004, leading to his imprisonment. The revelations about Cosby's predatory behavior led to widespread condemnation and significant damage to his career and legacy. His television shows were pulled from syndication, and he faced numerous lawsuits from his accusers. As of now, Cosby is 86 years old. His downfall serves as a cautionary tale about the consequences of abuse of power and the importance of holding influential figures accountable for their actions. Amanda Bynes born on April 3, 1986, in Thousand Oaks, California, is an American actress, comedian, and former child star. She gained prominence in the late 1990s and early 2000s for her roles in various Nickelodeon television series, including All That and The Amanda Show, which showcased her comedic talent and endearing persona. Bynes transitioned to film, starring in successful movies like She's the Man and Hairspray, solidifying her status as a rising star in Hollywood. However, Bynes faced personal struggles in the public eye, including legal issues related to substance abuse and erratic behavior. Her behavior became increasingly concerning, leading to multiple arrests and involuntary psychiatric holds. 
These incidents overshadowed her professional achievements and led to a hiatus from acting. Vine's disappearance from the spotlight was marked by periods of rehabilitation and attempts to regain stability in her personal life. Currently, she is 38 years old, and her story serves as a reminder of the challenges faced by child stars navigating fame and adulthood under intense public scrutiny. Gina Davis, born on January 21, 1956, in Wareham, Massachusetts, is an American actress, producer, and activist. She rose to prominence in the 1980s with standout performances in films like Tootsie and the Fly. However, it was her role as Thelma in the 1991 hit movie Thelma and Louise that catapulted her to international fame and earned her critical acclaim, including an Academy Award nomination for Best Actress. Throughout her career, Davis was known for her versatility and range, portraying strong and complex female characters across various genres. She continued to deliver memorable performances in films such as A League of Their Own and The Long Kiss Goodnight. Davis's commitment to advocating for gender equality in Hollywood led her to establish the Gina Davis Institute on Gender in Media, focusing on promoting diversity and representation in the entertainment industry. Today, Gina Davis is 68 years old. Her enduring legacy as both a talented actress and a champion for gender equality has solidified her place as a trailblazer in Hollywood. Michael Richards, born on July 24, 1949, in Culver City, California, is an American actor, comedian, and writer. He gained widespread fame for his iconic role as Cosmo Kramer on the hit television sitcom Seinfeld, which aired from 1989 to 1998. Richards' portrayal of the eccentric and unpredictable neighbor garnered him critical acclaim and multiple Emmy nominations. However, Richard's career took a significant hit in 2006 when he was caught on camera delivering a racially charged tirade during a stand-up comedy routine. The incident sparked outrage and led to widespread condemnation, tarnishing his reputation and resulting in public apologies from Richard's. Following the controversy, Richard's largely disappeared from the public eye and faced difficulties in finding work in the entertainment industry. Despite attempts to revive his career, he struggled to shake off the negative perception resulting from the incident. Now, Michael Richards is 74 years old. While he has made occasional appearances in television and film since the incident, his career has never fully recovered from the fallout of his actions. Kat Dennings born Catherine Litwak on June 13, 1986, in Bryn Mawr, Pennsylvania, is an American actress known for her distinct blend of humor and charm. Dennings first gained recognition for her role as Max Black in the television sitcom Two Broke Girls, which aired from 2011 to 2017. Her portrayal of the witty and street-smart waitress earned her widespread acclaim and showcased her comedic talents to a broad audience. Outside of Two Broke Girls, Dennings has appeared in various films, including Nick and Nora's Infinite Playlist and the Marvel Cinematic Universe's Thor series, where she played the character Darcy Lewis. While Dennings has maintained a steady presence in the entertainment industry, her visibility has slightly diminished since the conclusion of Two Broke Girls. Nonetheless, her dedicated fan base eagerly anticipates her future projects. Presently, Kat Dennings is 37 years old continuing to captivate audiences with her unique blend of humor and talent. Daniel Day-Lewis, born on April 29, 1957, in London, England, is a renowned actor celebrated for his method acting approach and intense performances. He comes from a distinguished acting family, with his father being the poet laureate Cecil Day-Lewis. Day-Lewis gained international recognition for his role as Christy Brown, a man with cerebral palsy, in the 1989 film My Left Foot, for which he won his first Academy Award for Best Actor. He continued to deliver standout performances in films such as There Will Be Blood, Gangs of New York, and Lincoln, 
earning him numerous accolades and cementing his reputation as one of the greatest actors of his generation. Throughout his career, Day Lewis maintained a reputation for being selective with his roles, often taking long breaks between projects to fully immerse himself in his characters. As of now, Daniel Day Lewis is 66 years old, having retired from acting in 2017 after his final film, Phantom Thread. His departure from the industry marked the end of an illustrious career that left an indelible mark on cinema. Linda Fiorentino, born on March 9, 1960, in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, is an American actress best known for her captivating performances in films such as The Last Seduction and Men in Black. Fiorentino's breakout role came in 1994 with her portrayal of the cunning and manipulative femme fatale Bridget Gregory in The Last Seduction, which earned her widespread acclaim and established her as a leading lady in Hollywood. However, despite her early success, Fiorentino's career faced setbacks due to reported clashes with directors and colleagues, as well as her reputation for being difficult to work with. These issues, coupled with a string of box office disappointments, contributed to her gradual disappearance from mainstream cinema. Currently, Linda Fiorentino is 64 years old. While she has made sporadic appearances in films and television over the years, her career never fully regained its initial momentum, and she remains relatively inactive in the entertainment industry. Bridget Fonda, born on January 27, 1964, in Los Angeles, California, is an American actress from the renowned Fonda acting family. She gained prominence in the late 1980s and 1990s with her roles in films such as Single White Female, Point of No Return, and Jackie Brown. Fonda's career was marked by a string of successful films and collaborations with acclaimed directors. She was celebrated for her versatility and ability to portray a wide range of characters, from the girl next door to complex anti-heroines. However, in the early 2000s, Fonda began to retreat from the spotlight, opting for fewer acting roles. While she continued to work sporadically, her absence from major film projects became more pronounced over time. Today, Bridget Fonda is 60 years old. Her decision to step back from acting was largely attributed to her desire for a more private life, away from the pressures of Hollywood. Despite her decreased visibility, Fonda remains fondly remembered for her contributions to cinema during her active years. Monique, born Monique Angela Hicks on December 11, 1967, in Baltimore, Maryland, is an American comedian, actress, and talk show host. She rose to fame with her role as Nikki Parker in the UPN sitcom The Parkers, which showcased her comedic talent and charismatic presence. Monique's career expanded beyond television into film, earning critical acclaim for her performance in the 2009 drama Precious, for which she won an Academy Award for Best Supporting Actress. Despite her success, Monique faced challenges in the industry, including conflicts with executives and allegations of difficult behavior on set. These controversies, combined with her outspokenness on issues of inequality and pay disparity in Hollywood, led to friction with industry insiders and impacted her opportunities in mainstream entertainment. Now, Monique is 56 years old. While she continues to work in various capacities within the entertainment industry, her visibility has decreased compared to her peak years in the early 2000s. T.J. Miller, born Todd Joseph Miller on June 4, 1981, in Denver, Colorado, is an American actor, comedian, and writer. He gained recognition for his role as Ehrlich Bachman in the HBO comedy series Silicon Valley, which showcased his improvisational skills and offbeat humor. Miller's career initially flourished with appearances in films such as Cloverfield, Deadpool, and Office Christmas Party. However, his reputation took a hit in 2017 when he was accused of inappropriate behavior and harassment by multiple individuals in the entertainment industry. These allegations led to his departure from Silicon Valley and tarnished his public image. 
Following the controversy, Miller's presence in mainstream media diminished significantly. While he continued to work on various projects, including stand-up comedy specials and voice acting roles, his career never fully recovered from the fallout of the allegations. Presently, T.J. Miller is 42 years old. His disappearance from the limelight reflects the consequences of his actions and the shifting attitudes towards accountability in the entertainment industry. And that concludes our exploration of 20 celebrities you may never see again. Did any of your favorite stars make the list? Let us know in the comments below, and don't forget to subscribe for more fascinating insights into the world of entertainment. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.